Hey everybody, today we're going to find out how to uh, make your, a static IP address. First off, you're going to go to start, click run, and you're going to type in CMD. Okay, this is going to pop up, nice little window. It doesn't always look the same as mine, because uh, you might have a different style of a computer that I do. You're going to type in ipconfig slash all. And whoa, a lot of people, a lot of stuff pops up. Okay. Alright, you're going to see an IP address, a subnet mask, a default gateway and a DNS server. I want you to copy down all the numbers that are next to those. Make sure you have them separated and you know which ones are which. This is a v the most important step out of everything. So uh, pause right now and then when you have all that written down, continue. Alright, now you're going to type in, after you're done with that, exit and then enter. And boom, it's gone. Alright, now you're going to go start. If it'll quit for me. Sorry about that. I right, go to control panel. You're going to go to network connections. And normally there's one, maybe two. This one's mine for sure. I know it is. And you're going to go to properties. Right click and go to properties. You're going to see a box that looks something like this. Doesn't matter if it's not exactly the same. You're going to scroll down until you find one that says internet protocol in, in a parenthesis TCP slash IP. You can click on that. It normally will look something like this. Normally. And then you're going to use the following IP address. This is my normal IP address. Alright. Now instead of that, you, I'm going to put a 0 after the 1. That's what you're going to do. Then you're just going to click. The subnet mask should automatically appear. That's my subnet mask. You're just going to be the same or different. Then you're going to type in everything else. The default gateway was... Uh, That's my default gateway. And then uh, you're going to type in the preferred DNS server. That's the only thing you're going to type in. So the DNS server is. Oops. You're going to type in the same thing for the second one. Then you're going to push OK. You know what, cancel that. Uh, I made a mistake just now. Uh, when you're doing the alternate DNS server, don't use it. Unless you know what you're doing, don't use it. I made a mistake. Okay. Then push OK and you're done. And uh, thank you. Uh, subscribe and comment and rate. Uh, sorry for that mistake in the last couple of seconds. Um, thank you. Uh, have a nice day.